Hello, some of you have asked, Rolo, you make stuff for Twitch. How do you do it for YouTube? And I was like, I don't know. I don't stream on YouTube. Okay. But I had to look for you anyhow. And I'm going to show you what I know now. The first thing that we're going to want to go do is we're going to want to go into platforms. We're going to want to go into the YouTube tab and then go to account and sign in with Google. And I've already done everything, so it's going to be quick for me. Then I'm going to go into our actions and we'll make a new one and I'll call this YouTube sub alert and I'll put that into YouTube alerts we're gonna hit okay we're gonna go into our triggers and we're gonna find something out we're gonna go to YouTube general we're gonna go into new subscriber and this message is gonna pop up this trigger requires stream elements integration to be connected to work i don't know why that is maybe um youtube didn't give the api to streamer bot but they did stream elements i'm going to show you how to connect the stream elements it's super easy if you have a stream elements account if not then make one and then do this so we're going to go into integrations we're going to go into the stream elements tab we're going to log in i already did it so it's nice and quick for me and that's how you do everything so far and we're gonna go into our actions again we're gonna go into our youtube and we've already got our trigger let's go into obs so i'm gonna go into my nested scene right here and i'm just gonna hit the plus sign and go into text gdi and we'll call this youtube sub alert we're doing a sub alert for youtube okay we're gonna hit okay everything's good so far then we're gonna go back into our sub actions we're gonna right click go into obs wherever the heck that is obs we're gonna go into sources we're gonna go into set gdi text we're gonna go into our nested scene or whatever scene you made it in and find that source that we just named youtube sub alert and i'm gonna put percent sign capital u s e r percent sign as just subscribed wow. and we're gonna hit okay and then we're gonna go back into obs into our sources and we're gonna go into source visibility state we're gonna hit okay now we gotta find wherever that is i have a bunch of them so it's gonna be hard for me to find you probably already found it and you're like it's right there click it but uh, i can't see it where is it three hours later oh it's right here we found it don't you worry we're gonna hit okay and we're gonna go into our core and i'm gonna make a delay for like i don't know five thousand milliseconds that's like five seconds right what bruh but that's fine for now we're gonna go into our source visibility state again and we're gonna duplicate that we're going to click on the one that we just duplicated and we're going to make it hidden. All right, okay. And I'm probably going to add a sound so you can add a sound as well. I'm going to show you how to do that. We're going to go into sounds, play sound. I already know that the sound's going to be loud, so we're going to put it at like 25. And I'm going to click this right here, finish playing before continuing because it like makes a weird delay if you don't. We're going to uh, go ahead and go and find this clown horn noise. We're going to hit okay. And I'm gonna probably put it like right there. Now let's test out our new trigger. Butt cheeks has <laughs> just subscribed. You naughty boy, don't move. <laughs> we can make that smaller so that way it fits on the screen. Let's test it out again. Doc Radio Game has just subscribed. We can still make it smaller. Anyhow, that's how you make a sub alert for YouTube streaming. If you found this video helpful, please give me a subscribe. Follow me on Twitch, twitch.tv slash Rollison. Let me know what you think and whatever the kind of videos you want to see. I appreciate you guys. I'll see you next time. Bye.